Hey, what's going on, YouTube? It's David with another Skyrim Dragonborn DLC commentary. I have some good news and bad news. People generally want the good news first, so I'll tell you that. There are spears in Skyrim, but the bad news is, they don't seem to be any more than just a troll move by Bethesda. I'll explain later. Now, as you can see, I'm getting attacked by Ricklings with spears as both a stabbing weapon and a throwing weapon. Rickling settlements are extremely common places to find spears and the settlements themselves are very common in the wilderness. So as you can see, I'm inciting this guy to attack me with spears and he is missing a lot of his shots. Finally he hit and the shield deflected the spear entirely. And the shield is continuing to deflect the spear. I'm trying to see if there's any spear stuck in my body, they don't seem to be at the moment. And I'm just going to stab this guy to death. So let's loot him and see what the spears look like. There's a bundle of them, and I'll loot his buddy. Alright, let's see what happens if we equip the spears. Nothing, they take the place of arrows, you can't physically use them as a stabbing weapon, so I have to get a bow to try out the spears. Alright, now I'm going to draw my spear. And it just looks like a reskinned arrow. It's really thick. I don't think it takes a little bit longer to draw, but you saw the base damage of the spear. The base damage of the spear is incredibly low. So I'm just going to go into third person so you can see what the spears look like on my back. And what they look like when you draw them with a bow in third person. So the reason why I say Spears might have been a troll move by Bethesda was ever since the game's launch, there were repeated rumors about Spears being included in the coding of the game, Spears being included in a downloadable pack, but now we do have Spears, but the thing is, they completely suck. So now I'm going to show you Spears in combat and what they can do. All I can say in response to this inclusion of Spears in the game is, well played Bethesda, well played. Oh, don't worry about the damage output. My guy's not an archery character. I don't have any perks invested in him. But pretty poor damage nonetheless. This is the most significant thing you'll notice. Spears do not have a lot of range. Look at how quick the drop was. Now I'll do a range test on this guy. Good from that distance. A little farther back. Oh, you can see the drop a little bit more prominently. And yeah, that's a pretty harsh drop. I don't think spheres are leveled. I'm pretty high level right now, and I think I'm pretty big on encountering anything that could be leveled in the game. And there don't seem to be any variations other than the Rickling Spears. So now we'll see how Spears can protrude out of people. Look at that short range of the Spear. So we pick up Spears off the ground. It's pretty easy to do. And yeah, the Spear can completely go through a person. See what it looks like. Let me flip him over. Looks like it's right through his pelvis bone. So now I'll show you my range with a regular arrow. I have no problem hitting these guys even though I'm a low level archery guy. So there you have it. Spears are in Dragonborn DLC. They completely suck. I think your best bet if you want actual spears is to try this game on PC because there are mods for spears and other throwing weapons. Or you could play RuneScape. Actually, don't play RuneScape. Have a great day, guys.